the fisherman and the jinn Abdul was a poor fisherman. He had been sitting by the river with his net but had not been able to catch any fish the whole day. He said sadly, "It's getting late. If I don't catch any fish soon, I will have nothing to eat tonight. His tummy was already grumbling. Just then he felt something getting caught in his net. It must be a really big fish. He said happily. and he tugged hard with a lot of effort he pulled the net out he was surprised to find an old strange brass jar instead of a fish he was curious and so he opened the jar Immediately a lot of white smoke came out of the jar. Once the smoke went away, he saw a huge ferocious looking genie in front of him. It was an evil genie called Jin. Jin said to him, I have sworn to kill the first man I see when I am released from this jar. Now you must prepare to die. Poor Abdul stood trembling. Please let me go he cried I set you free I helped you you can't kill me but Jin would not listen Abdul knew his only hope was to trick Jin So he said Okay you can kill me if you must but before you do Will you tell me how a big genie like you can fit into such a small jar? Jin laughed. <laughs> you fool. I'm a powerful genie. I can be taller than the mountains or smaller than a little rat if I want. He boasted. I don't believe you. Go into the jar and prove it to me. Replied Abdul. Immediately, Jin became very small and vanished into the jar in a puff of smoke. Before he realized, Abdul quickly closed the jar tight. He had trapped Jin in the jar again. Quickly he picked up the jar and threw it far away back into the river. He never wanted to see it ever again. Thus, the clever fisherman outwitted the evil genie. <laughs>